Goff Rugby reports five best men's college teams that didn't make the 2019 fall playoff. Number one, Salisbury. Well, the thing about Salisbury was they did make it into the second, third playoff in the Chesapeake, but it could have been so much easier for them. They tied two games during the season. Had they won those games against Maryland and Mount St. Mary's, well, they would have had bonus point victories, and they may have even finished first in the league. As it was, very, very close to getting into the national playoffs, and who knows, had they got in, they might have done some damage. Number two, the U.S. Coast Guard Academy. Well, they finished four and two in the New England-wide con conference in Division Two, and they just missed out on a couple of opportunities to get a little bit higher. In the end, it came down to one game against Boston University, a game where they were down only 15 to 12 at halftime, and they ended up kind of uh, losing the plot late in the game. But had they held on, well, we might have seen them in the playoffs too. Number three, Louisville. Remember that Louisville beat Bowling Green University during the regular season in the MAC, led by Taryn Meek and Isaac Bales. Really great work from the Cardinals, but they didn't quite finish it off in the playoffs. They ended up third, and we know who finished second, Western Michigan. They're in the final. Maybe at Louisville is good enough to be there too. Number four, Wisconsin Platteville. Now it's kind of a weird pick because eight teams from the great Midwest make their conference playoffs. And we're picking a team that didn't even get to that point, but they were so very close. They lost by less than a try to Minnesota Duluth. They lost by less than a try to Marquette. Had they won those two games, well, they'd probably have been third in their division, maybe higher, likely playing Loyola Chicago in the playoffs. Had they gone further than that, well, they just win that game, they're probably in the national playoffs and in the conversation. Number five, Bentley. Hey, remember when Bentley beat Norwich at the beginning of the season, 12-11? We're thinking maybe they're one of the best teams in the country. That's actually still true. Even though they ended up losing to UMass Lowell in the regular season, even though they ended up losing to UMass Lowell in the Rugby Northeast playoffs, that dumped them out of national playoff contention, but they were still a very high quality side. And you see the fact that Norwich made the national semifinals. You think, well, maybe with a little bit of luck, Bentley might have been there too. So that's our top five teams that didn't make the national college playoffs in the fall. Let me know what yours are.